If you are the lead presenter for a session, you will see a special menu item called Manage My Sessions. When you select it, you will see a list of all of the sessions that you are authorized to manage. All of your sessions will start as being closed. If you want to allow attendees to have a discussion about your presentation within the mobile meeting guide, you need to select the closed button to change it to open. Select the title of your presentation in order to access several tabs which organize the tools available for your session. They are Stats, Discussion, Messages, and Survey. The Stats tab will tell you how many attendees have added your session to their planners, and if you uploaded a handout, how many handouts have been downloaded. Users do not need to add your session to their planner in order to download the handout, so the second number may be larger than the first. Under Discussion, you will see all of the current discussion threads for your presentation. You can reply to any current topic, start a new topic, or, if necessary, remove an entire topic or single response since you are the moderator. Users will identify any new topics or responses you make in the discussions by the green bar next to the item. At any point, you may close a currently active discussion. This will hide it from attendees, but it will still be available to you here in Manage My Sessions. You may then manage the discussion as necessary, and then reopen it if you want. Just toggle the Open Close button next to the session name. Using the Messages tab, you can send a message to all attendees who have added your session to their personal planner. This message will be sent any time someone adds your session, even if it is days or weeks after you originally create and send the message. Simply type the message in the box, and then select Send. Once you do, you will find that message in your Outbox in Messages. If an attendee responds to the message you sent, the response will appear in your Messages inbox. Included in this year's Mobile Meeting Guide is the ability to create and send survey questions. Like Messages, these only go to attendees with your session in their personal planners. Select New Survey Question to create a survey. Type your question in the first box. You may have anywhere from two to five multiple choice answers. Fill in as many as you need and leave the rest blank. Then, select Done. At this point, you may still edit your question and answers. Once you are happy with your survey, select Send Survey Question. Your question will now appear as a message in the Messages inbox of your potential session attendees. Once the survey is live, you can return to this section from time to time to see the count of respondents. Remember, attendees will only see your question when they check their messages, so plan to leave your question active for several days. When you are ready to stop the voting, return to this section and choose End and Show Results. The results will display as a chart. The same results will now also show for anyone who has your question in their messages inbox. If you want to continue voting on this question, you can choose Reopen Voting, and the results will disappear, and any attendee who has not yet voted may do so until you close it again and show the new results. In addition to attendees' inboxes, the results of closed surveys will show in the discussion for your session if the discussion is open. Attendees can only vote once on any survey, and the meeting guide will remember and display which answer they chose. Use the survey option to engage your potential attendees and assess consensus before your session, or garner feedback after your session. If you have questions about any of the presenter tools, email Mobile Meeting Guide Tech Support at aao.appriser.org, available in the Mobile Meeting Guide Help section.